Now it's time for our game of the week, and we are at the Jackets Nest for Thomas County Central and Lee County. A couple of good 5A teams squaring off. Important region game. Early on, Lee County strikes first. That's Devontae Say right up the middle for six. But then it was the Adam Choice show after that. Here he rolls left. Breaks a couple or makes a couple moves, doesn't break any tackles, is pushed out of bounds, and then with the keeper goes right up the middle for a touchdown. Beautiful play there. And then choice again, option play, but he ditches the play, cuts back upfield. That's why he's going to Clemson. Hard to bring down there. That is a touchdown for Thomas County Cent Thomas County Central. And right now, the score to that game is 45-14. Thomas County Central wins. That is a final. Fox 31's Doug Reardon was out at Thomas County Central tonight, and he's going to provide a little extra analysis for us. Doug? Yeah, thanks, guys. It was an absolute barn burner for the first half. I got to tell you, this was my first experience with Georgia football. I'm from the north. I've never seen anything like this before in my life. This is good football. It, it was, like I said before, it was an absolute barn burner in the first quarter, first, excuse me, first half and first quarter. After that, after halftime, they went into the locker rooms, came out. I don't know what the Thomas County coaches said in there, but TCC came out swinging for sure. Adam Choice, that quarterback there, I feel bad for my Terps next year when they have to go up against him. He's committed to Clemson. Final score here, 45-14, a phenomenal game. Johnny, Patty, back to you guys in the studio. Thanks, Doug. I'm glad you got a little taste of some Southwest Georgia football. Well, tonight it was Thomas County Central and Lee County and more good options next week. Valdosta will travel to Colquitt County. That'll be a tough one for them. And then America Sumter and Cairo, they'll try to take on the syrup makers there. America Sumter, they need a win. Brooks County and Cook is an option, and so is a little private school action here. Southland Academy and Tift Area Academy.